In this video, we will show what is new in V6 3.8. During this demo, we will switch between V6 3.7 and 3.8, opening different browser windows to show the changes. Here we have V6 version 3.7. And this is V6 version 3.8. As you can see, V6 version 3.8 has a cleaner, sharper, updated look and feel. One of the goals when designing V6 3.8 was to have a much more consistent modern look, but without impacting the updating process from 3.7. If we open a quote in V6 3.7, we have this look. While in 3.8, there is a clean, consistent, modern feel. To give the sharper look, we have changed a lot of the colors, the active and inactive elements, fonts, headings, margins, and alignments. One of the other key features in the new design is standardizing the icons. You will see here all the icons that we have in 3.7 are a mix of color, size, shape, and look. In 3.8, all the icons now have been redesigned and updated. We used a more standard look with a flat and monocolor icon set to give them more consistency and a sharper image. Another key change from 3.7 is removing the ribbon bar. As you can see in 3.7, we have the ribbon bar at the top with all the icons spaced along the ribbon. In 3.8, we have replaced these with drop-down menus. This saves a lot of space and improves the screen real estate available to the design board. The new drop-down menus are all customizable. So you can pick what menus you want to display and which items will appear within the drop-down menu. Along with the new design changes, one of the key workflow changes made in 3.8 is the item navigation. In 3.7, the item list is only seen within the main quote tree. Now, in 3.8, there is a new item view which allows you to see all quote items within a page. The page view can also be changed to show as a list or tiled view. Another new key feature is the new item navigation through the breadcrumb navigation link at the top left of the page and the next or previous item at the top right of the page. This provides a much quicker way to navigate through quote items and back to the main tree. Within the item navigation is a new search field. In here we can type and search on the description of an item that we want to find and now it is highlighted. This makes it very simple to find an item within a quote. In 3.7, when moving between active windows, often the easiest way is to minimize one window and select another from behind the active window and then maximize the new window. In 3.8, we have introduced a new Window Tabs feature. Now you can have multiple windows open at the same time. Each new window you open will show as a tab. This makes it much easier to move between different windows. And because all open windows show as tabs, you can always see at a glance exactly what windows are currently open. This new feature means that in 3.8, you could have a Quote Browser, report browser, and the quotes you are working on all open and all easily accessible by selecting the relevant tab. If you prefer your tabs ordered in a particular way, simply drag the tab to your preferred position. Tabs also include a special function which allow them to pop out and detach from the tab list. Once a tab is popped out, it becomes a new window that is separate from the main V6 window. We can move the new window outside of V6 and onto a second screen, or we can drag it to use the standard window split screen function. The popped out tab is a totally separate window. Going back to our V6 window, we can pop out another tab. And then we can drag it to have it on the other half of the screen. Now we have two quotes open next to each other at exactly the same time. 
Once done, we can easily pop the windows back into the tabs list. When working in a quote, previously in 3.7 we had all our quote tools in a ribbon. Now in 3.8, we have a quote action bar on the right hand side with all the tools. This quote action bar is fully customizable by clicking on the settings button. In the edit window, we can select to add or remove the options we want. The last feature to present is the changes to the navigation and action bars. In 3.7, the navigation and action bars could only ever be separate toolbars. Now in 3.8, we are able to expand or collapse the navigation bar, and the navigation and action bar can now also be combined into a single toolbar to save space and improve screen real estate. Before we conclude this video, a quick overview of the main changes that are waiting for you in 3.8. A new look and feel. The ribbon bar has been replaced with a multi-level drop-down menu. One maximized active window at a time has been upgraded to multiple tabs that we can pop out. A new item navigation and an easy update process from 3.7 to 3.8. Thank you for watching.